Shalom. Let us say our praises due unto Yahweh. Ba Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Ba Hashem, Rakah Kodash. Double unto the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and blessing to the hopeful members of the elect. This lesson is going to be entitled The Tribe of Manasseh and the Order of Santa Domingo and, uh, and Cuban slavery or something. You know, um, I'm going to be flowing in the spirit. Um, short lesson. Uh, this is Genesis 48 and 1. All right. And it came to pass after these day things that one told told Joseph, Behold, thy father is sick. And he took with him his two sons, Manasseh and Ephraim. Right? And we know that Manasseh, you know, you so called Cubans, or right? you Ephraimites, you um you so called um over there in um over there in um like over there puerto rico you know that body like body rica whatever they call it in the spanish you know you guys over there in uh, that puerto rico all right and uh we you know we and we know through the spirit you know through uh apostle or high priest Arya, you know who uh you know he the heat the Mosai is dealing with him you know and um gave him that revelation as to who the tribes are throughout the America miracles right and um so it shows you that you know masha is a, a great man um you know in this thing ours and one told jacob and said behold thy thy son joseph cometh unto thee and israel and israel strengthened himself and said unto upon the and sat upon the bed right so you know um you know becoming like jacob he was getting sick he was dying you know in his old age and um his eyes was dim and jacob said joseph joseph god the god almighty appeared unto me at luz in the land of canaan and blessed me and said unto me behold i will make thee fruitful and multiply and i will make thee like to and I'll make of the uh, uh, like multitude of people, and I will give this land it, like to thy seed after thee for inheritance forever. Right? So uh, you know, so um, like Joseph, you know, with his two sons, you know, Jacob was given, you know, his uh, you know, his grandsons. You know the blessing um you know my um my sister her uh, grandfather her father's f and father you know uh they're cuban and basically uh they're like first first generation jamaican but there's a lot of them um because they migrated from cuba to jamaica so there's a whole bunch of them down there and um my sister my mom you know they, uh, they always went to they like my sister went to cuba i think 2019 or 2018 and everyone looks at my sister they're like and um and and the people like they're like oh like you know like you know like they're saying because she can't speak the spanish but they're looking at her and they're saying you know like they're looking like you know she's cuban she's cuban she's like you know um you know because um a lot of our people was already going back and forth and prior um we you know we were uh you know we were you know like prior to slavery you know we had you know like civilization you know um you know um 
pre-Columbus and during the like the Columbus period, a lot of uh, a lot of the Moors and uh, the Templars, right? You know, uh, like they set up shop, they build up churches and all that, and um, they set up these different orders. You could put like the order of Santa, like the order of Santiago. You know. I already made a lesson about that, so if you could, you want to go on my page. Um, that was like a couple of days ago, the Order of Santa Ego, because um, um, this is uh, slack here. Because also, I'm gonna uh, put this too, the Ace Live in Cuba, he's like a YouTuber, and um. There's also um, Ace Life, like Joey Diaz. He's Cuban and uh, Italian, but uh, you know he he like he's uh, he's going into the Santeria. You know this is the stuff what are people involved in. You know and uh, this is what's going on in Cuba. That's why the most are judging our people, man. You know, but I'm gonna continue Genesis 49, and um, I'll start at eight. Genesis 40, Genesis 48 and eight, and Israel behold Joseph's sons and said, Who are these? And Joseph said unto unto his father, They are my my sons, whom the who the power Yahweh have given me into the in, in like in this place and he said bring bring them and i will give thee unto thee and i will bless thee and the eyes of israel were dimmed for uh, for age so he was really getting older in age his eyes were dim so that he could not see and he brought him near unto and he kissed him and uh, braced him and Israel said unto Joseph I had not thought to see thy face and lo Yahweh have shown me all all thy seed and uh, Joseph brought him out between his feet and he brought him himself with his face to the, and he bowed his face to the earth and Joseph took him both Ephraim in the right hand and towards the Israel's left hand and Manasseh in his left hand and Manasseh in his left hand that toward Israel and uh, Israel's right hand and brought him so you know he basically he he, he crossed you know he crossed them you know like you know like he uh you know because he had basically like they crossed paths you know and basically you know um um that jacob you know is all set up in the spirit because you know because ephraim was gonna get the blessing you know and you know that ephraim apart from uh, judah you know um, like Ephraim is the head, you know, of the northern tribe. All right, and um, you know, like that's why, even during um, pre-slavery, you know, like we were always in the Americas, you know, and um, you know, you read about uh, about the uh, Haitians too, the Haitians. You know, like they would, you know, like the Haitians were freeing the slaves. You know, um, I'm probably gonna uh, like post it on my um, on my uh, on my YouTube. You know, the Haitians they play the a, a, a great role of you know of freeing our people throughout throughout on um, like Venezuela, throughout Central America. You know the Haitians uh, played a a major role. 
in freeing our people. All right, so um, you can't sleep on them, man. And um, you know, also Manasseh, uh, the, the tribe of Manasseh, Reuben, and Gad. You know, they were you know like they played a, a major role. You know, in um, you know like they were like the um, you know like they were like the Navy SEALs you know of uh, Israel you know like during the land uh, you know um, like during the time of uh, you know like a Joshua you know like when we're gonna inherit the land you know and um, you know and um, go into the maps about uh, Joseph no, if you go into the maps of uh, Ephraim, no, it's like not Ephraim, the tribe of Manasseh, Reuben, and Gad. If I could get that map, all right, you could do your research also. Um, you know, like like Santiago, Cuba. You could do your research. Um. The Order of Santiago. Alright, slavery in Cuba. Cause I'm kinda running out of space. But I was gonna um slack here. Uh map of Gad Ruben and Manasseh. That's why we have to go into the maps, you know, because, um, you know, they were, uh, you know, that they're the ones who, uh, they're the valiant ones, you know, the mighty ones who were, uh, okay, you know, who, uh, you know, that's why Gad, Rubin, and stuff, they're, they're mighty, man, you know, there's a lot of, uh, Stuff, but, um, when we get Genesis 49:22, Joseph is a fruitful bow, even a fruitful bow by a well whose branches runneth over. You know, they have a whole bunch of children, man. You know, and um, it said the archers have sh have the uh, sore sorely grieved him. And shot at him and hated him, you know, with, uh, you know, when the Edomites came to power, man, you know, they, you know, they persecuted them, you know, these so-called Tainos or uh, you Arawaks, you know, they were being persecuted, you know, and even right now, you know, especially Cuba, man, you know, Cuba was a uh, very luxurious, you know, they were very, uh, you know, you no know, like pre-slavery, but you know, right now Cuba right now is like destabilized. You know, with this whole um, this whole uh, this whole socialist, this communist or, or the so-called communism, which was set up. You know, um, you know Fidel Castro, the Cuban Missile Crisis. You know, during that time, man, with the Russians and stuff. You know, and basically, uh, you know, you know, it was a cold war back then, but now this is going to be a whole um, nuclear war, you know, and um, that's why um, Donald Trump is saying, you know, that basically, uh, you know, World War Three is 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 here, you know. But I'm gonna keep going. But his, but his bow abode in the strength, and the arms of his hand were made strong by the hands of the mighty power of Jacob. For he, for uh, thence is the shepherd, the stone of Israel, 
right so he you know because uh, apart from the tribe of judah you know ephraim you know or joseph which would be ephraim they're gonna play a a, a major role you know and uh you know all the tribes is gonna be kings and priests but uh, prior um you know, prior to that, you know, ten tri the ten tribes, you know, Ephraim was at, you know, what that was the top, because we know that after the time, uh, the fall of uh, Solomon, you know, the kingdom was split because of what Solomon did. Even by the power of thy father, whom shall help thee, and thy Almighty, who shall bless thee with the blessing of heaven above blessings of the deep that live under the blessings of the breast and of the womb the blessing of thy fathers have prevailed above the blessings of my progenitors unto this uttermost bound of everlasting hills thy shall be on the head of joseph and of the crown of the head of him that are separated unto his brethren all right so um that's pretty much it um you know now uh you know our people over there in cuba you know and also um uh our people over there in puerto rico is catching hell you know, cause our it's cause it says that Ephraim is joined to idols, man. Believe in the uh, in in Hosea, Ephraim is joined to idols. Let them alone, you know. And it says that Ephraim's as a silly dove, you know. So um, you know, so there's gonna be a lot more judgment that's gonna be coming throughout, um, you know, throughout the world, you know, here in Babylon, and um. Now it's the time to get right, you know, because we're in some serious times. So be aware, be circumspect, you know, because things is happening quickly, you know. So with that, let us say, I pray to do unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem Rakakwadash, the ones of the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and blessing to the hope of members of the elect. Uh, shalom.